Last night ended in a different way than day one has ever ended for us. We ended up in a medical center last night. And it's also a birthday cruise. Yes. Somebody's selling a birthday this week. All right, so it's embarkation day. We are pulling up in Miami. We just dropped off our bags. So our porter has our bags. We got five bags for the four of us for the seven day sailing. We packed heavy. The outfit, they ready. It's time to board the Icon. Come on, it's embarkation time. Is it gonna be a new song? It's gonna be the same old jam. Best part of waking up is getting on a cruise. Yay! We are here! We're here, we're here, girls! First impressions. Yes. Wow! It was amazing! It was amazing, honey! Oh, is that what I think it is? Something nice. Alright. Five seconds, what do you think? It's good. It's good. You've been here five seconds, what do you think? I think it's already been here. You've been here 30 seconds, what do you think? 30 seconds, amazing. It feels like you walked into a mall. It is huge, huge, very huge. spacious. So the cabins are ready. The Icon did not sail yesterday. It's been docked in Miami. So we're gonna go to our cabin and leave all our bags in the world. All right, so we just got off the elevators. Yeah. And I will give them their credit. The whole way for the elevators is, is huge. I don't know how it's coming across. I'm gonna keep saying this. I don't know how it's coming across on camera. Well, you know what? But in person, it's like huge. I can literally like. What do you gonna literally do? What, what can you, you literally, literally do? do? She can literally. Like, oh! What the hell? Oh, we see you, right? Okay, all right, go ahead. All right. Yes, you can just do cartwheels, backflips, all that jazz. That's how big it is. That's how wide it is. Do you see something? What did she run into? Surf side. Woo! Oh. <laughs> Maybe. So, a lot of people are very impressed, but we are definitely impressed with the size of this space. You'll see every single YouTube video is going to talk about the elevators. Guys, these elevators are on MSC. They these are elevators on are on Carnival. Yes. How old is the Horizon? 2017, the Carnival Horizon came out, and these uh, destination elevators are not a new thing to cruising. I have been on many ships with these destination elevators, so just stop saying they new. It's, it's so, new to Royal Caribbean. Yes. But if you cruise other cruise lines, you would know that it's not really new. Are we ready to see the cabin? I'm ready. Let's go to the room. I want to see. I want to see what it's giving. I got a balcony, girl. I don't know what it looks like though. I just let Daddy just. I see ya. Do the book. Six nine eight. Okay, I thought we had the room that's all the way down at the end. No, I made a adjustment. Wait. <laughs> Let me see it. We're supposed to be, Surfside is facing that oh, way. Channel. This is facing the ocean. Surprise, surprise. That's surprise, what I. Surprise, surprise. I didn't know that I was about to be surprised. Well, okay, guys, we have the bouquets. Let's do it. Dun, dun, Thank dun, you. Dun, dun, you too. So when you walk in, it could be connecting, it could not be. Oh. You're 698, so you are on the left side. Oh, wow. This is crazy. It's about to get 
crazier. Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at our room! Look at our room! Oh my god! Wow! Wow! We got this room! Whoa! Oh my god! What are we thinking? I told you I booked a balcony in the Surfside area. This is a balcony. But it's I, an infinite you can see family. Like we're gonna be looking down at the Surfside area. We got the infinite. No, I never said we'd be looking down. I said we'd be in the Surfside area. And here we are. We're in the Surfside area. See, this is what I leave it into Rich's hands. But I never. You guys know we don't really do much balcony. I mean, we do balconies, but an infinite balcony this is something new for us because that's on the Celebrity Edge class ships, and that's new to this. This, Can this we go ship. see the girls but area? Cause see, gotta, it has a whole chalkboard. Guess what, mommy? We also have a TV. TV. Let's we see. Have let's see. TV. Wow. 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 You guys have bunk beds with your own TV. And they have curtains. Look, the up the upstairs bunk and has their own curtains. And we have our own thing. Wow. Your own thermostat. Wow. Yeah, Wait, I, this, this chalkboard <laughs> is huge. You no, guys can write on a no, chalkboard. No, wait, wait, no, we can't. They're gonna give you chalk. Don't worry. Yay! Wow. No, no, don't erase it. It's beautiful. It's gonna say Happy Birthday, Ray. Hey. And why does our TV says Hello? Are we in the right room? It says Hello, Brittany, Dominique, oh, no, Melinda, no, and no, Kathy. Oh no, no, no! It says Remnering. Don't worry. Wait, what? I want a greeting. This should say Remnering family. All right, icons. It's time to eat. Let's see what the buffet is talking confused. about. It's an inaugural, so we're expecting. What's this? Dish? We're expecting treats. We're expecting goods. What are we expecting? We're expecting a lot. Lobster. Push. Just say it. I know that's what you're. We're expecting, expecting lobster. <laughs> and that's where I'm going, Bob. So if you don't know where you're heading, of course, at the elevators, there's a directory. Check that out. And where are we heading? Do we know? The Windjammer, deck 15. Deck 15. So you're gonna press this one, two. Three, four. Oh, Girl, it do you it. made that up. The whole precedent. The is made. other cruise lines do that. This is not the other cruise line. Yeah, well, I'm telling you now. <laughs> it makes sense. You're supposed to press it four times. So you know how many people. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Windjammer. All right. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. Oh, we got we got more food. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. Pretty woman. Okay. Washing down the scene. Pretty woman. And walking down the street. Pretty woman. Uh huh. Uh huh. Let's do it. Uh huh. Uh huh. I wash it. Uh huh. Uh huh. Let's do it. Uh -huh. Oh, look at that. All edible, I assume. Wow. That's really nice. Now that's a lot, a lot of cupcakes. Look closely, guys. It's a cupcake. Isn't that cool? Alright guys, so we are in the buffet. Now I don't know if this is going to be, let's say you're coming October 2024. Let's say you're coming next week. I don't know if it's going to be a lobster thing, a mussel thing, a king crab. Thing. King crab. Okay. <laughs> king crab, okay. The calamar, the mussels, ooh, and the stone crab. We make a variety. We love variety. No, the spread the spread is real. The spread is spreading. The seafood is seafooding. If you're not a seafood eater, they do have all the other accoutrements to protect the meats and stuff. I'm pretty sure Richard will show that. But I'm focusing on something that's not normally on a salad. So it's very nice. One hour later. All right. How are we feeling? How are we feeling? I'm done with my seafood. Extravaganza. So when you get on board, you definitely want to do your safety check-in before you get too settled. In this area, you got guys with a vest that says, ask me. If you don't know where to go, ask them. It also should be on your cabin door. All right, the entrance to Adventure Ocean is huge. 
So you got Adventure Ocean Babies, which is for six to 36 months or three years old. So Raina Royce will be in the Hangout. So it's a six year group walk, which is, could be a good thing. A six year range, yeah. a little bit bigger than I expected. It's a little bit bigger than I expected. Maybe six to 10 would be better. All right, so they close at 1 a.m. If your kids stay after 10, it's $10 per hour per child. Okay, so this space, very really nice big. spacious. They have nice loungers, TVs for your children to watch. Then you've got the Adventure Ocean Juniors, which is three to five years old. The workshop room is very nice. It's like an arts and craft room. I'm sure they'll be doing a lot of lead classes with these with the kids. It, this is looks better than most classrooms, okay? It is humongous in here. Lots of space, and it, it's like this room can accommodate, well we said it's six to 12, so we can accommodate lots of children at the same time. Stop. Air hockey. Stop. Stop right now. Join us on air hockey. Okay, right now we're playing air hockey, but one of us, one of you guys need to join. Okay, you guys, right now we're about to join Arena, six to 12 years old. So right here is like some like tablets and like some games. And right over here is like soccer. It's an arena. Uh -huh. So you can play it's a, soccer. It's like an indoor sports arena. Yeah, soccer. I'm sure they'll have lots of games in here for you. There is like no reason that you guys should say that you're bored in here. <laughs> Absolutely. When I come to pick you up, you should be, oh, we don't want to leave, right? Yeah. This is really nice. I'm sure they're going to have lots of games, lots of stuff. You're going to meet lots of kids. And make sure y'all stick together. You hear me? All right. So this is the theater, guys. What do you think? Nice. Very nice. You'll be watching some movies in here, huh? Movies and looks like a stage. This is very nice. All right, guys. So we're just coming upstairs to get a little views of the upstairs. And so far, it is so nice. We're here. This is a local fresh here. So we're pretty much at the back of the ship, I believe. And we are going to have a little cocktail. We're ordering our very first cocktail for the day. And now it's time for the very first drink. So this is called the Category 6 Hurricane. Uh -huh. It is $14 for this drink. It's good. The bartender made it very nice. All right, so we're back in the cabin. Do you guys switch colors? Oh, I want this one because it's Yeah, blue. because it's blue. Okay, all right, all right. So we got puzzle beads, but I ain't no open this 250 pieces of That's nice. Time for us to open this. Yeah, we don't really know what that is. We're trying to figure I that out. it's like a blanket or a towel or something. Okay. It looks, like a, it looks like it has like handles. Yeah, I think you need to open that up. There you go. Rip it. Okay, rip it. See a handle. What does it do? What happens when you open it? I think. What is it? A beach mat? Oh, like a beach mat. Oh. Like your lady did this for gymnastics. Guys, this is crazy big. Beach mat. That's really nice, Royal. Thank this is you. Very nice. Thank, Thank you. you. Just for kids? Yeah, just for the kids. This right. is really nice. Then we got, we forgot to tell him about we were missing a hat. I told him. Oh, okay. So we got the hats, we got the memorabilia book, uh -huh. we got the puzzles, and a huge beach mat. Because why would the biggest cruise ship in the world give you a small beach mat? They gave us the biggest big beach mat in the world. world. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Something I want to show you is that the cabin comes with four of these wire baskets. I really like these baskets because a lot of our clothes come from patpat.com. Use code JazzLife15 if you never use my uh, shopping discount code. But a lot of our family matching outfits come in these bags. And I'm able to just fill these baskets up, take like two or three of them, because it's not that many drawers. And then also, this area is not really wide enough to put clothes on. It's good for like the packing cubes that Richard has up here. And then we have our clothes hanging and then you can hang clothes here. But the, the wire baskets are great. And I'll just throw the shoes at the bottom and I'll put the girls' shoes in their area. All right guys, so we showered and we made it out of the room. We're in the main dining room tonight. So in the main dining room tonight, it's a standard Royal Caribbean seven day sailing. It's a welcome aboard menu. I had the tomato soup, which actually was pretty good. We have the prime rib now. I'm Actually, today, the prime rib is the best prime rib I've had in the main dining room for Royal. Is it the main, best um, prime rib I've had in my life? No, but it's pretty good for main dining. 
Am I in frame? Yes. Oh, y'all can just watch me tell this food. <laughs> I thought it was on you the whole time. I'm gonna be like, the broccoli is very good. Yo, the broccoli is very good. Yo, the broccoli like mac. It's not like garlic in it, right? <laughs> I thought it was just me. Yeah, I ate the broccoli. I want to be like, the broccoli is very tasty. The broccoli is so good. Nice and crisp. <laughs> it's very good. This is a very good meal. I enjoy it. Don't frown upon going to the main dining because you've already spent an astronomical amount to go on this cruise. So why yeah. spend extra? But we are, who am I to talk? We do have some specialty dining <laughs> later on this week. So you we're guys so, will see that. We're so used to giving tips on saving right. that when we're splurging. I want to hit all audiences <laughs> here. I like to I like to hit the audience that like to splurge. I want to hit, hit the audience that likes to save. I want to give you all those tips. I want to try my best to at least reach everyone's pockets. You're going to enjoy this series <laughs> because we're spending some money on this one. Oh yeah, we're spending some money. All right guys, so in true Rich and Jazzy Life fashion, See what I did there? In true rich and jazzy life fashion. No, don't see what you did there. All right, I gotta work on this. We're gonna give you a fashion show yes. real quick. Just know that the lighting is a little bit weird, but we're gonna make it work. So yes. tonight we decided to go with an Indian att attire and we're going orange.
She's fine. She's gonna be fine. <sighs> so, you had x-rays done. What'd they say? Yes, I, we might as well record the memory, okay? <laughs> There's no major fracture, but of course with their equipment, they're not radiologists, so they can't tell if there is any hair yeah. left. They said after two to three days, if the pain is still there, I need to follow up with a physician. But obviously it's a seven day cruise, so I will be on the ship until next week. Follow up with, <laughs> I with me. Follow. But I'm confident that I will be all right. I know that my mother is watching this. My mother is very sensitive about ankles, and she's probably watching this like, oh, probably crying for me. Like, I will be okay. This all occurred because of balloons. I just want everyone out there to know that. The hey, balloons guys, are back. when you see balloons, do not go. Be safe. I'm done with balloon drops on there's, the there's, there's two things. One and done. I'm One and done. I'm never doing a balloon. There's two drop things again. I have to warn you about a balloon. What's the other something else? High heels with balloons. High heels and balloons don't mix. I mean, get into the shoes, baby. She was cute. She was cute. That's why your ankle looked like that. I was, but look, I was cute. I was with my heels. You're not, no, like literally, what are you supposed to do if somebody literally pushed Yo, the lady clobbered you. Clobbered me. <laughs> Richard has it like somewhat recorded, right? Yeah. <sighs> clobbered me. And next thing you know, I was on the floor. And poor Royce was on the floor as well. Thank yeah. God Royce is okay. I'd rather be hurt than Royce. Yeah. How you feel? Good. Good. And you? I was on the floor, bro. You I were never on the floor. Said, Why? When were you on the floor? She got tired as well. I did fall on the floor. Yo, you're making stuff up. I, I did. Go to the room. Daddy, how old was you when you got home? Last night ended in a different way than day one has ever ended for us. Yes, we ended up in a medical center. Um, I don't know if it's filmed or not, but I've the balloon drops. Everyone's stomping all over the balloons. I personally will not attend a balloon drop or. Well, like, you're gonna have PTSD from like and stand like where the balloons are dropping anymore. Yeah. Because it's like complete chaos. Everyone's like stomping. It's, they might as well call it a balloon stomp. Because I thought they would be like hitting playing. the balloons to so it could like start bouncing everywhere, you know? Yeah. But, but that I didn't wasn't know what the was instant happening. The reaction was for everyone pop, to pop, pop, pop like they've never seen balloons before. Oh my gosh, it was like a bunch of kindergartners when they see like stomping on balloons. It was really, really bad. At the beginning, it was nice, like, oh, how when pretty. When it fell, it would look yeah, really nice. Yeah, it looked nice. really nice. But, but then, then they started acting like animals. And then this lady topples over, knocked me over, knocked, Roy and then I knocked Royce over from me being knocked over because Royce was standing next and to me. And then I knocked over Ray. And, and we all on the floor. Girls are crying and it was just Jasmine couldn't move. I'm, I'm trying to get her up and she's like, I can't move I could like not my move. ankle. I can't stand on my ankle. So I had to go get security. And then they called the um, medical team. They came up and took her down to the medical center in a wheelchair. Yeah. And luckily they took x-rays. You know, these ships do, are. it's really like a real hospital. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not like a radiologist, but so it's not really that detailed in the x-ray, but they said just looking at it, they could tell that it was no breaks or anything. Mm -hmm. Thank God. No I don't, fractures. Yeah, I didn't want to have nothing major like happen. I want to enjoy my vacation, of course. Yeah. So um, they gave me some ice packs. They also gave me, what do you call this thing I have on my foot? 
uh, a ace, just uh, a, little a brace, support, an a ankle brace. brace. They gave yeah. me that. They gave me packs of ice, and they um, someone wheeled me back to the room. Um, they kept they. They were going to give me medication, but I told them I had my own medication and my husband's a nurse and I will be all right. So I just kept my foot elevated throughout the whole night. We went to bed. What's early for us? And No uh, casino. No casino. No nightclub. No nightclub. We yeah. went to bed pretty early. I woke up and luckily I'm able to stay. I was like, please let me be able to stand on my foot. My foot. So I'm able to stand on my foot. I'm going to keep the um, bandage on for, throughout the day. Because I have some nice heels and stuff I need to get back into so wearing. You need, a, you need your you, ankle to recover yes, fast. Yes, I need my ankle to recover fast because I got the palm. She got the shoes, darling. You check out the shoes. Don't y'all want to check out the shoes? So, um, yeah, that that's pretty much how our night ended. We're just going to continue to go through the ship at our own pace. Mm -hmm. And we're enjoying it throughout the way. Take it day by day. Take it day by day. And you guys just follow us along as we take it day by day. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog. And until the next time, guys, continue to live. Rich. And Jazzy, live. Bye, Bye guys. guys.